Understanding Shaft Diameter, a simple guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase shaft diameter. This might sound technical, but don't worry. We'll break it down in simple terms. By the end of this video, you'll understand what it means and how to use it in context. Let's start with the basics. A shaft is a long, cylindrical object that rotates or spins. You can find shafts in machinery, like in motors or engines. They're essential for transferring power or motion from one part to another. Think of it as a rod that turns around its axis. Now, let's talk about diameter. Diameter is a term used in geometry to describe the straight line passing from side to side through the center of a circle or sphere. It's basically the width of a circle. When we measure the diameter, we're finding out how wide something is from one side to the other, passing through the center. Combining these two concepts, shaft diameter, refers to the width of the shaft measured straight across its circular cross-section. It's an important measurement in engineering and mechanics because it determines how much force or load the shaft can handle. The larger the diameter, generally, the stronger the shaft. To understand this better, let's look at some examples. In a car's engine, the shaft diameter of the crankshaft determines how much power the engine can produce. In industrial machinery, the shaft diameter is critical for ensuring that the machine can operate safely and efficiently. Measuring the shaft diameter is straightforward. You use a tool called a caliper, which can accurately measure the width of the shaft. This measurement helps in selecting the right shaft for a specific application or for maintenance purposes. That's all for our lesson on shaft diameter. We hope this explanation has made the concept clear and easy to understand. Remember, it's all about the width of a rotating shaft in machinery. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more English learning videos.